Anti-radiation missiles are guided missiles designed to home in on and destroy radars and other energy transmitters. India's Defence Research and Development Organisation is developing an advanced state-of-the-art anti-radiation missile that can target enemy radars and communication facilities. This is a state-of-the-art air-to-surface the range of the missile is believed to be 100125 km and it will be mounted on the combat aircraft of the IAF such as Sukhoi and Tejas light combat aircraft the entire missile is being developed indigenously, including the seeker. The missile picks up the radiation or signals of radars and communication facilities and homes onto the targets to destroy them. Instead of thrust propulsion, the missile uses dual pulse propulsion. The benefit of dual pulse propulsion is that it will widen the envelope as well as the engagement capability of the missile. In February 2016, it was reported that captive flight trials of anti-radiation missile are planned for April-May this year, and the maiden flight test by year and by the missile technologists of the DRDO according to DRDO sources. Scientists will evaluate the performance of the seeker, navigation and control system, structural capability and aerodynamic vibrations during the captive flight trials. These will be followed by ground testing and the missile will be fired from Sikhoi Su-30 MKI during the actual flight trial by year end. The missile will be inducted in about two years after conducting a number of developmental trials. As of now, only a few countries. Top things to know about this missile 1. Production of the arm, which is among the most advanced missiles, is being undertaken on priority basis by the Defense Research and Development Laboratory DRVL. 2. Arm is an air-to-surface tactical missile indigenously developed by DRVL including its heat seeker. 3. The arm is used to take out surface-to-air missile SAM sites during an air raid on an enemy country. 4. It is capable of targeting enemy's air defense capabilities by attacking radars and communication facilities by picking up the radiation or signals from these facilities. 5. These missiles can detect radar by tracking its electromagnetic radiation and pulses generated and would be independent of the radar wavelength, being able to destroy it. 6. This indigenously built tactical missile is an air-to-surface missile ASM with a range of 100 km to 125 km 7. Instead of thrust propulsion. The missile uses dual pulse propulsion system as in the case of LR SAM. The dual pulse propulsion will widen the envelope as well as the engagement capability of the missile. 8. The missile will be mounted on India's frontline air superiority fighters like the Sukhoi Su 30 MKI and the indigenous multi role fighter LCA Tejas. 9. The armed missile will be inducted into Indian Armed Forces till 2018 after successfully conducting a number of developmental trials. 10. Such missiles, currently in use of some major powers like the US, can detect and attack the radar antenna or transmitter with men.